Ross William Albrecht was arrested at around three o'clock in the afternoon at a local branch of San Francisco's public library. He was accused of using the internet and being logged on as the administrator of the Silk Road website. Federal agents have been tracking the site since 2011. They've made around 100 drug trades, everything from cocaine to heroin. The site's also used to traffic things like firearms and even information, for example, on how to hack an ATM machine. In the criminal complaint against Albrecht, the FBI agent lists various charges, everything from narcotics trafficking to money laundering. The site used bitcoins, which is a digital currency, and the FBI seized the biggest haul of bitcoins in its five-year history, $3.6 million. A small amount, though, compared to the $1.2 billion that the site is estimated to have turned over since February 2011. Perhaps the most intriguing charge against the 29-year-old is that he was engaged in a murder-for-hire conspiracy, trying to enlist the help of one of the site's users to execute another who was threatening to make public the identity of all the users of the website. In place of the Silk Road today, a simple FBI notice. While the closure of the site is no doubt a victory for the federal authorities, the so-called darknet in which it operates is a big place. The Silk Road may have been the most infamous by far of all the black marketplaces. You can be sure there are many others in the wings simply waiting to fill the void.